Hello guys, it's nice to have you back in my channel. I decided to do a special video to talk about how to search for scholarships in Germany, how to search for undergraduate scholarships and graduate scholarships and even PhD scholarships in Germany because I believe this would be of a great benefit to you. Here are some of the benefits of studying in Germany. Germany has one of the best standards when it comes to education. It is open to all international students there are no tuition fees in public universities in Germany, so getting a scholarship is basically to take care of your living expenses and that is a plus. You can work as a student in Germany and after your studies, you can apply for 18 months for study visa to search for a job. And if you get a standard job, you can apply for a permanent residence after about 3 years. In my previous videos, I have talked about how to search for tuition free universities and courses in Germany so that video would definitely be of help if you want to study in Germany you can check it out after this video now let's go into the main reason for this video how to search for graduate and undergraduate scholarships in Germany this video will help you to know how to search for scholarships and apply to many scholarships multiple scholarships and therefore increase your chances of getting a scholarship this video promises to add value to you so therefore smash the like button and subscribe if you have not and turn on the bell notification so that you don't miss future updates as well i would like to see your comments and just let me know where you're watching from all right guys let's get into it so this is the website where we are going to be searching for scholarships so i'm going to teach you how to do this and um, it's quite easy um if you look at the left side corner you are going to see refine your selection so here you already have some scholarships that you can see here but first you have to refine your selection you can decide to use a particular course for example you want to study um, business administration you can decide to search for course specific scholarships but um, i'm going to leave that open i'm not going to put a specific course for this example um, if you look at the next one what are you what program are you searching for is it undergraduate or graduate i'm going to um, give examples with graduate first uh, then i will come back to give examples for undergraduate but i'll advise you to watch um, this uh, example even if you are going for undergraduate i'm going to do graduate first so you select graduate course there and you select your country of origin uh, to make it more specific so i'm just going to select nigeria right here you can select your specific country and then you want to select the subject um, if you want to be specific so these are groups of subjects so you select the one that is closely related to your feed but i'm going to leave it empty and then the intention you have to select study so you can also look for scholarship for language course you can look for scholarship for internships teaching or uh, phds uh, doctorate but for this masters i'm going to click on study and then you can also tick this box if you want only that scholarship but since i want open program both those scholarships um sponsored by daad and those not sponsored by daad um, to study in germany i'm going to leave this on ticked so i can click on refine selection so you discover that this list is going to change and you're going to have courses that you can apply to uh, i mean scholarships that you can apply to so these are different scholarships first of all you can look through what you have here status is graduate um you can see country of origin only specified so architecture and related courses can apply to this scholarship so this is an example of a subject specific scholarship so there are other scholarships right here but i want to give you an example with the very first one so i'm going to click on it so when you click on it you can find out more information about this particular scholarship you can first of all read through the overview you can see the overview you can see the application requirement you can see the application procedure and i would advise you to watch this video on landscape so that you can see um, very well what i am trying to show you and you can see contacts and how to submit your application 
So let's go through the overview for this particular scholarship. You can see um, who can apply. So to apply, you have to be a foreign applicant who have gained a university degree in the area of architecture, interior design, on urban planning or urban development, landscape architecture. So it's basically courses related to architecture. And let's look at what is covered in this scholarship. So let's look at the value right here. You can see the value of the scholarship is a monthly payment of 861 euro. Um, you also get your travel allowance. You also get a one-off study allowance when you come in and you also get payment towards your health insurance and the likes and you also get monthly rent subsidy and monthly allowance for accompanying members of family so this is a full scholarship you can also bring your you can bring your family members along with you so you discover that this is a very full package there are a lot of benefits and you might not know about this that is why this video is really interesting uh, you can actually search for a scholarship that you don't even know about and you, you start applying to this scholarship and by the grace of God, you are going to get this scholarship. So the list of benefits is still very many. You can see right here, I can't even read everything. So there's a lot of benefits for this particular scholarship. But there's an architect out there that does not even know about this scholarship. That is why you also need to share this video. So let's just go through and you're going to get all the information you need from this particular page. So when you read through, you are going to get all the information. Um, for this particular scholarship, you have to apply for admission separately uh, and then apply for the scholarship separately. You can apply for admission and then apply for the scholarship even if you have not been offered admission. So what you can do is to, is to come up here and click on application requirements. You can read through the application requirement. So this also applies to other um, scholarships from the search result. So you can read on the um, application requirements what you need to do as the first one right here says as a rule your university degree should not date back more than six years at the time of application at the time of the application deadline so um, that also applies to this scholarship read through the application requirement make sure you meet the application requirements to stand a better chance to get the scholarship so you can also look at the application procedure but for this particular scholarship like i said you need to submit all your documents to the dart portal this is the dart portal the website we are currently in is the dart portal so you can read through because i'm not specifically talking about this scholarship i can give you more details but i believe you can get everything from this page and you can also ask questions from the contact you can see contact information and then submitting your application you click on this you can see uh, number one here what you have to do is register on the dart portal so they are giving you the exact guideline to apply to this scholarship so you can even click on this link right here to read notes about registering on the portal so if you don't know how to register on the portal you get the information from here and then you register on the portal you request for the reference you download um, all the necessary online application forms you feed them submit them back to the portal and do everything you need to do submit your admission letter if you have already gotten your admission letter and upload everything you need to upload and submit your application so it is quite simple and for this particular um, scholarship you can apply to any university and then you come back to apply for the scholarship so the, right now we go back to the search results so you can see this is quite interesting there are a lot of scholarships that you do not know about that can actually benefit you and i would beg you to look at this closely and apply so i'm not going to um, go through every other scholarship so closely but for this one i'm just going to show you right here you can see this is in the field of art design visual communication and film so if this is your feed then this is a scholarship for you so you can look at it so this also applies to different countries depending on the country that you have searched you are going to get the scholarships that are applicable to you so you can check the different information you can see the list of subjects if i click on this i can see this is for the field of engineering art music and sports scholarship postgraduate studies in the field of music if you're in the field of music this is also for you so the list is very long and this is the um, development related postgraduate courses that is the dad epos scholarship that i've talked about in my channel so this is it right here also in case you don't know about it you can check my channel i've already talked about the dad eps scholarship it's a fully funded scholarship it covers everything and including your flight ticket to germany and even 
your family members can come in and they are also paid so um, you can check that at my channel so you can see the list is very long you can check through the list and look for scholarships until you get a scholarship that fits you perfectly so right now we are going to come back to the um, search form well let's search for undergraduate courses also so i'm just going to change the graduate and um, select undergraduate right here so i'm still going to leave nigeria but you can use your own country to do this i'm still going to leave study and then i'm going to click on refine your selection so i've done that and you can see the list have changed these are different scholarships a lot of persons are asking for undergraduate scholarship in my videos i can see the comments um so these are this is a way to search for undergraduate scholarship in germany so you can see the status is for undergraduate and graduate like this particular scholarship is also for graduates so you can click on it and read through it understand the scholarship understand the requirement very important and how to apply so those are the two important things the requirements what you need to submit the documents you need to submit as well as how to submit those documents so once you understand those three things then you can submit your document also understand the deadline and make sure you submit your application before the deadline so uh, if you don't understand those things you can send in a comment um, i will try my best to answer and also you can but the best thing you can do is to send an email to any email address you find in this uh, link they will be ready to give you the best information so you can see a lot of other scholarships right here for undergraduate programs so there are a lot you can check through them um i will go to page theory because i want to show you one uh, which is quite interesting so on the third page you can see the um, sbw berlin scholarship so this is for undergraduate as you can see right here so i'm going to click on this one um on this page you can see the overview you can read through you can see the application requirements you can see contact information about the school right here so if you have more questions you can send an email to this link to this um address right here email address and it is quite simple anything you don't understand you just ask over there okay so you can see this scholarship right here let's look at the scholarship value you see it's a full scholarship and it includes the tuition fees uh, which are completely paid you can see a furnished room in your shared student apartment so accommodation is also provided for you and if required a living allowance per month so you also get a living allowance per month and if required assumption of cost for the required certification and legalization of documents so everything so including your travel expenses it is also covered counseling during the scholarship period so these are a lot of benefits that are really interesting for undergraduates so you should take this opportunity and get more information about the scholarship and apply to it if you're looking for undergraduate scholarship in germany you can also see the application papers right here the documents you need to submit so it's quite simple just go through the documents you need to submit have the documents and submit them if you have questions you can also get across to the school there are a lot of other informations right here you can read through and you can see the deadline for application there are two periods of application for this particular scholarship so the first period you have to submit your documents between 15th of november to um, 30th of december and for the second period you need to submit between 15th of may to um, the 30th of june so this one is coming soon if you have your documents that are listed as here I think uh, you should look at this scholarship and apply to it if you have gotten any value so far why not hit the like button you can share this video to your friends and your family and you can also drop a comment i want to know where you're watching from and yeah most importantly make sure to apply to these scholarships so guys i'll i'll drop the link to this particular page in the description you can check it out you can also visit my youtube page right here for more opportunities and also make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss the next opportunity you can come down right here on my youtube page you can see a lot of opportunities right here tuition free universities if you're interested in norway you can see the um, ual master scholarship worth fifty thousand pounds 
you can see a lot of scholarship like the Hemo Smith Master's Scholarship in Germany. You can also look at the Daddy POS Scholarship that I mentioned earlier. So there are a lot of other scholarships in different places in Canada, in uh, Australia, in Netherlands. So a lot of opportunities right here. And uh, these are first class information that benefits you and your friends. So also make sure to share these videos and uh, make sure to apply to this scholarship, search for what fits you best and success in all your endeavors. Bye, see you in my next video.